Hey everybody, it's Buds from Buds Northeast Outdoors here. Uh, glad to be back. I've uh, been off the YouTube air for a while. Um, had issues with my health. Had really bad kidney infection, double kidney infection this last summer. Um, doctor told me if I uh, I was prone to getting kidney stones if I went out in the hot sun. We know it was really hot most of the last summer. So I stayed in the house next to the air conditioner with shade, and I developed a couple new hobbies. I make lures now and a couple other things like that. Um, I got a smoker, and that's pretty cool. I've, I think you've already seen that. I've done a couple things in it. I made smoked meatballs. Uh, I made uh, burnt ends out of pork belly. Uh, I don't believe I videotaped that one, but anyway... Um, <clears throat> only went fishing twice all year last year. Second time, uh, I, f I forgot to turn the camera on, never recorded anything. Um, so, and, uh, my drone got crashed. That black one that I had, uh, a couple hawks attacked it down at, uh, Lunkerville, Stumpfield Marsh. So, I don't have that drone anymore, but I got a replacement. And that should be fun. We're going to go out ice fishing this year, and that should be enjoyable. I, I can get some drone footage with that. That should be fun. And it, I, I'm i probably better off doing it over hard water, because you can't save the drone. Those hawks slam that thing twice. And unfortunately, with the return to home thing, what happens is the drone drops down about 5 feet and goes up about 20. And when it does that, it does it in a very slow manner. So... It doesn't really hurry about it. And the Hawks had plenty of time to lock in on it. So this year, like last year, I plan on doing a lot of camping. First trip's Little River. Second trip's Woodford. Um, great water up there at uh, Little River State Park. Um, the Woodford Park has Harriman. It has Somerset. It has Sadagua. It's got its own little pond. It's There's a trout pond just down the road. It's, uh, I believe it's like a designated trout pond in New Hampshire. So it, it's like, I almost believe it's reclaimed. It's only trout in there. So we'll go down and do that. that that's on 4th of July, so I don't know how well the trout fishing will go in a little pond. But we'll give it a shot, just so I can say I fished it anyway. Trying to fish a lot of new water this year. Going to go down to Manchester, fish Massasebic. I, I want to go up to uh, Island Pond in Washington, New Hampshire. I've been wanting to do that for years, and that place right there just looks so fishy from their little boat landing. But it's a pain in the butt to launch a boat into that place and then park with a trailer behind the car. So what I'm going to do is I just got my little canoe I modified. I got a trolling motor on it, fish finder, all that stuff. It's almost like a little mini boat. Or one of the fishing kayaks. It's actually an old town, uh, I believe it's 11.4 for the length on it. And it's basically like an open kayak, open top kayak. Uh, you, you use a kayak paddle to paddle it around with. It was very tippy and I made a stabilizer for it. I'll show you that in some of the mods I've done on other stuff. I've, I've modified my little pullover shanty so it has LED lights like full time in it. And it's got a switch so I can turn the upper and lower lights on. So if I drop something on the ice, uh, I can turn the lower lights on. I can have the upper light on for tying hooks and stuff. You know, it's going to be a good year. I've made a lot of cooking videos. I've got a couple extra subscribers. Uh, a lot of things have happened since I see you guys last. We've had layoffs up to work. We're not working any overtime. But I guarantee you business will pick up just as soon as open water season starts. But all my all my camping trips are all, all reserved and already pre-approved for time off. So as long as we're still there, that should go okay. You never know. Could be laid off. I may have a, a lot more time on my hands than I'm planning on. But anyway, it's good to be back. I missed you guys. Thanks for watching. And stay tuned. It's going to be a lot of decent videos this year. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.